best looking cars that I've ever done and I went to talk to a guy named Perry just to talk about a couple cars that I'm interested in but I had to come take a look at this this is the AMG GT four-door uh, 4 liter V8 twin turbo 577 horsepower there's one in the showroom that has a red leather interior which might just be the nicest interior I've ever seen so let's take a look at this bad boy door version of the AMG GT which is a uh, Mercedes sort of entry-level supercar I guess you could say but this car has some unbelievable performance figures but look at the brakes and look at the wheels uh, you've got the yellow calipers now this this sort of is like the four-door version but it still has the balls out performance now look at the back of this car look how big these exhausts are holy shit this is honestly one of the best looking cars Mercedes has ever made uh, GT 63 look how wide those hips are I mean this is just unbelievable you've got Michelin tires carbon ceramic brakes I mean this is just unbelievably gorgeous car Michelin Pilot Sport 2's now coming up to the front you've got the I guess they call it like the Panamericana grill the giant Mercedes roundel right here um, LED headlights I mean this thing is just an absolute beast now this car is $153,000, but it will probably do 200 miles an hour. Twin turbo V8, AMG noise, I mean it is an absolute beast. So let's go on the inside. Alright, going to the inside of the AMG GT 4 door and oh my god. So look at the just design of the wood and Mercedes has all, you know, a brushed aluminum everything. There's not one piece of plastic in this car. AMG kick plates, AMG on here. Now look at this interior. My god. You've got the, I think it's two 12.3 inch screens. Oh my God. Now, unfortunately we're not gonna start this thing up because it is a unbelievably expensive car and just, just to have the access to be sitting in this, I, I feel very lucky. Now, like I said before, there is a car in the showroom with a red leather interior, but obviously this is black with the silver. This is, this might be the nicest interior I've ever sat in. It's just, it's beautiful. I mean, AMG does unbelievably beautiful displays. Um, I sat in the A-Class inside, which is an entry-level car, but has all the technology uh, with the huge screens. But look at the steering wheel and the vents and the huge screens. Now, I know these buttons are like haptic controls that when you, they sort of go in when you press them, but oh my God. It just has sort of like a waterfall design right here with these big four vents. And my goodness. This is, this is unreal. This is, I am uh, pinching myself. This is, pro this is the nicest interior I've ever been in. Um, they even have a 63S, which this car is not, with a little bit more power and luxury, and they have an Edition 1, which there was a, one of those in the showroom last year with like, last week, with like 630 horsepower. Oh my God, this is just unbelievably nice. Um, but yeah, so if you are not a fan of German cars, go look at this car and just say that Germany is on fire. I mean, I'm a BMW guy, but I love German cars, but this car is just unreal. I mean, I, I, I sort of came to Mercedes to look at a couple other cars, but thought I had to go take a look at this. So I don't know all the specs about everything, um, but man, this is just stunning. Even this like wood has like a little little bump over the things here. My god. 
All right, so I'm gonna do some beauty shots of this car and then I'm gonna go back, get out of here. But thank you to Perry at Sun Motors Mercedes uh, Benz and hope you enjoyed this video. If you are a lover of cars, this car fits the bill in so many ways. I'm sure this will do zero to 60 in three and a half seconds and sound like an absolute rocket. I mean, Mercedes makes uh, muscle car noises. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one. See ya. Oh, 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 oh,